So this is, I mean, is this, is this sort of a treat food or, I mean, I know you see you could eat it for breakfast, but is it literally people eat it like in England, they eat, I don't know, shepherd's pie, it's an everyday. Well, it's an everyday thing, but it's also a treat food because if you have this as a breakfast, yeah. you know, it would be a special breakfast you would, okay. you would have, you know. Um, as kids, my grandma would serve us Aki and Sophie's as breakfast if she wanted us to do some housework. Okay, okay, you know, so it's like Yes. And it's loved by everyone. It's loved by everyone, everyone. Like absolutely. absolutely. Levi, are there, uh, yeah, does every sort of, um, Jamaican housewife have her own recipe for uh, Yes. For this? So this is your own particular... Yeah, this, this, this is my own style. This is what we did at the carnival. We, we developed a style at the Notting Hill Carnival throughout the years that we've experimented on, on, on the part here is there. Next, what we'd had here, we'd had some black pepper. Now, in is, is this expensive to buy in a tin? It is. It is about four pounds a tin. About it's four, actually so one it of the most expensive, expensive okay. Caribbean um, export things there is. Okay. So what you would add now, next to now, you'd add to your favourite sauce, of course. Your <laughs> tomato base sauce, tomato yeah. Tomato base sauce, <laughs> yes. And as with me here, you can add a little bit, but with me, I can add a lot of it. And also, would you yeah. use, at this stage, would you put hot sauce in yet or not? You would. Yeah. You could in, in there, because you've got to... You've got to make sure you have everything in before you put your ackee in. And of course you can add a little time bit of time in there, of course, just to keep a little bit of flavor in there, yes. And now Beautiful. you're ready to add your mashed finishing touch. Yes, finishing touch. Like I said, it's very delicate, so... And you want to keep it in that sort of brain-shaped thing. Yes, right? yeah. yes. So it's nice and whole. Okay. Once you've put your ackee in, you don't want to disturb it too much, so that's that's virtually ready because everything and, is cooked. And it's just cooked, yeah, cooked down. Just for put a few your ackee in and just leave it for a few minutes, let it warm through, okay. and then Bob's your uncle, you're ready. Lovely, ready. okay, let's get Fantastic. it served. So we're ready here. Let's get it on a nice bit. This is Jamaica's national dish here. Oh. Fabulous. So everyone has their own recipe. Right? Everybody has their own way of doing their ackee and swordfish. And this is mine that was taught to me by my dear old grandmother, Miriam. And there's some dumplings to go with this as well. Yes. So how have these been made? These are just flour. Kneaded really? flour together with a little bit of salt in there so and just bread, fried. Then yes. straight into Self raisin yeah. flour or plain flour with some sort of raisin stuff in there. Lovely. And it'd be fantastic. And this is our traditional breakfast. It's a very hearty breakfast, isn't it? Yes. And this is our Aki and Saltfish Jamaican style. Beautiful. Thank you very much. To make Levi's dish, buy some salt cod from the fishmonger. Get some spring onions, red and green peppers, scotch bonnet chilies, ginger, fresh thyme and garlic from the greengrocer. You also need a tin of ackee and some spicy tomato sauce. For the dumplings, make sure that you have self-raising flour, butter and vegetable oil.